from the mind of my daughter, Erin. This story is called Brandon the Speedo. Once upon a time, there was a boy named Brandon. He loved going fast on his scooter. His nickname was Brandon the Speedo. Every day, he would ride his scooter to school, zooming past his friends and feeling the wind in his head. In the mornings, Brandon would wake up early and get dressed quickly. He couldn't wait to jump on his scooter and race to school. As he rode down the street, he would weave in and out of traffic, feeling the rush of the wind against his face. He loved going fast and feeling free, and he knew that nothing could stop him when he was on his super speedy scooter. At school, Brandon would park his scooter outside and head to class, feeling energized and ready to learn. During recess, he would take his scooter out and show his friends all the cool tricks he could do, like jumping over obstacles and spinning in circles. His friends were always impressed by his speed and agility on the scooter, and they would often ask him to teach them how to do it. In the evenings, Brandon would race home on his scooter, eager to tell his parents about all the exciting things he had learned at school. He loved the feeling of the wind against his face as he zipped down the street, dodging mums and dads, swerving around dogs and jumping over cats. On the weekends, Brandon would explore the city on his scooter visiting all his favourite spots and discovering new ones. His friends would see him coming and shout, make way for Brandon the Speedo, Here he comes! And Brandon would give a big high five as he speeds past. As Brandon grew older, he never lost his love for his scooter. Even as he got his driver's licence and started driving a car, he still preferred to ride his scooter whenever he could. It reminded him of the freedom and excitement of being a child, and he knew that he would always be Brandon the Speedo at heart. And so, Brandon continued to ride his scooter and enjoy the thrill of going fast. He knew that no matter where life took him, he would always have his trusty scooter by his side, ready to take him on another adventure. 